In this video, we look at integrated development environments and some of their common features. Let's look at some of the common available tools in an IDE available for writing Python programs called IDLE. Now you may have used this IDE before and on its face it looks like it's quite feature poor. However, you'd be surprised by the number of built-in features even a simple IDE like this provides. We have automatic highlighting of where a syntax error has been found. We have features to allow us to easily common out entire sections of code. Here we see another error has been identified. This time it's due to the incorrect use of indentation and we're being told this in the error message. We have features to allow us to automatically indent entire regions of code. Here we also see a runtime environment and also an output window. Here we see a debugger window which we can turn on. This provides us with a whole range of tools and information when we run the program. You can step through the program one line at a time while it's executing. It shows you exactly what's happening and what line of code was just executed. You can even see the current contents of various variables and other data structures and what and how they change and update as you step through the program. Here we see the ability to change the font type and the font size used by the IDE, although I'm not suggesting what we've got here is obviously ideal. The IDE also provides you with the ability to change or customise how the code is being highlighted. So even with a simple IDE such as IDLE, we can see now that there's a range of tools which are being provided. These include help with keyword syntax, changing the size of the source code, coloured keywords in the source code, a simple find and replace function. The ability to comment out and indent sections of code. A runtime environment and output window. A selection of debugging tools. The ability to step through code line by line as it executes. And the ability to trace the value of variables. Now there are much more feature rich IDEs out there. One you may be familiar with is Visual Studios, which can be used to program a large number of high level languages. This is developed by Microsoft. We can see here a lot of the similar tools we just went through with IDLE, along with additional tools such as auto code completion, which help to speed up programming. That's everything you need to know for the exam. Pause the video and take some notes.